Welcome back, non-consensual towing, rolling in hot. Anyway, we're uh, we just pulled up here to Gainesville. We got we got a vehicle they won't remove, so we're we're gonna yank it. Last time I was at this property, they were doing uh they were doing a remodel. They uh they actually had inspectors inspectors here. We've got new grass. Yeah, there's a work in progress. I don't know if we're gonna have any uh have any problems. I remember this car the last time I was here. And I remember that they uh they were giving this this person uh extra time. Uh, to get this car fixed and uh, evidently they haven't uh, evidently they hadn't done it so this is the one right here it's a vet I bet you 95 percent of all military personnel or ex-military are armed they're always armed you, you, that's the one thing you better learn about towing, you, when you mess around with veterans, man, they they got guns, man. I don't care if they got no money, they got a gun. This is how they are. reiterate um, this property for some reason they've given this uh, particular resident uh, they've given him extra time uh, I've been towing cars out of here you know we towed about six or something like that out of here and that car's been here and they've ignored it and have not towed it um, and I think that's because the guy's a good resident or could be a female uh, but they've given this person uh, ample time to fix the 2019 plate and they and they just hadn't done it so and it comes a time you got to draw a line anyway we're back rolling in on another property we got this one on the back from uh, Gainesville now we got to grab a trailer I may even have to drop the one I got it depends on the trailer mm -hmm. looks like it's being kind of being hit so the question is, is it stolen or can't never tell. Anyway, we're gonna we're gonna yank it. I'm gonna drop this uh, this Acura I got on the back and I'm gonna pull back up here and I will lift the Acura. I gotta put that big text on the uh, I gotta put it on the back of the bed. Anyway, it was stickered right there. 14,000. Stickered right here three times, four times, five. Uh, this trailer was stickered five times. It's got no VIN, VIN plate on it at all. Nowhere that I could find, maybe six times, I don't know. No VIN plate anywhere on this thing. Anyway, I'm gonna explain the reason why they pull these VIN, VIN plates off these trailers, especially a, a nice trailer like this. I'm gonna explain that to you in just a second. 
Anyway, back on the trailer topic. Uh, if you own uh, if you own multiple trailers and you go out and you uh, you register one trailer and you get a tag and you think that tag is going to work on all the trailers, and I guess they will. Uh, but you got to pull your vent plates off. You got to pull the vent number, your vent plate off the trailer in order to keep from getting caught with the wrong tag on the trailer. So you pull your vent plates off. Anyway, the tow company shows up and your uh, your tag is on is not on that trailer anymore because it's on a different trailer you're using and uh, you uh, you get impounded. It gets to the impound lot. The impound uh, the tow company can't uh, can't run the VIN number on it. Can't run the VIN through the uh, through the DMV through the system, and it comes back as nothing. So you show up to try to get your uh, trailer back. You got a bunch of documents, man. Uh, those documents go to a trailer. Only problem is, there's no no way to prove uh, what trailer those documents go to because you remove the VIN plate. Now, does the tow company have to release that trailer back to you with no VIN plate? That's a catch-22. It really is because you can't prove you own it. There's no numbers on it. So everybody needs to quit pulling their VIN off the trailers. Stop pulling the numbers off of them. It's not smart. It's, it's And I know a lot of people do it too because they they, they, they try to avoid the repo guy too. That's a good way to keep the repo guy from, from getting it. But the to regular tow guy's gonna get it anyway. He's gonna get it for no plate. Uh, so you might beat the a repo guy on pulling the VIN number off. You might beat him on it, but you're not gonna beat the tow company that gets it. And they're gonna sell it at their auction. I guess you can go buy it back at the auction when they auction it. Anyway, it is what it is. We're we rolling in on these trailers. I got three trailers I got to haul out of here. The three of them got uh, stickers on them. What's going on, y'all? Idea yeah, who's this one is? No idea. <laughs> okay, yeah, in that third one there. Yeah. yeah, they don't know whose it is either. They don't know. They, they said they don't know whose it is. No, nope. it's probably their old one. <laughs> Yeah, but they, they don't want it. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a bigger model of the same one. Uh, that was a bigger model of the same trailer. Um, anyway, yeah, I'll, I'll get both these loaded. I'm going to put that small one on top of here okay. and haul yeah, them all three. You got something to cut that chain with? Yeah, I can cut it. Okay. Yeah, I, I can cut yeah, it. I'll cut it. I'll be on trying to tell you from having to pull yeah. up out of here. Yeah. The man is not, he's not, uh, you know, already ordered the sign, so yeah. everything got to go. Yeah. What did he say? Huh? Oh, he, that's, that's his on his truck, but I'm going to let him know he can't leave. Yeah. When you get all mad, huh? Yeah. Hey, yeah. don't get mad yeah. at me. He didn't get mad at me when I come back and tow it. <laughs> Y'all no tell sense. me, hey. Ain't no sense in that. I'll come back, I'll come back and get it. Yeah. You let me know, I'll come back and get oh, it, man. Yeah. yeah. If you can bet on that. Getting all mad at the maintenance guy for warning warning him about the trailer. I'll take that new one just like I will the old one. They call it in, it'll get towed. I think the other trailer, the other trailer belongs to him anyway. I'm almost certain that trailer belongs to him. And uh, he don't want it no more.
What's going on? This ain't his old one. This is his old one, ain't it? Yeah, this is his old trailer right here. He got that new one, and this old one he don't want no more. Huh? Huh? Now, this is his old one, man. I ain't nobody. Come on, man. This has got to be. It's just a like. He got to upgrade. It looks just like it, man. You know what I'm saying? This one's worn out. He got him a new one. I don't know how many trailers I've hauled, uh, how many trailers I've impounded and hauled in my in my tow career. But I tell you what, it's been a bunch, man. It, uh, I have towed, towed a ton of trailers, man. Anyway, the guy with the new trailer back there, I think this is his old trailer, or it's one he bought, or something along those lines. Uh, he was getting pissy with the uh, maintenance uh, maintenance man. The maintenance man told him, hey, you can't park that trailer here. Uh, you need to check with the office if you're going to. And uh, he got, I couldn't catch the whole conversation. That's why I got out, because I thought the guy was going to get ugly with, with the maintenance dude. He was flat ugly to the maintenance guy. He didn't get pissy with me, but he got nasty with the maintenance guy. Anyway, no talking about that. We're going to strap. I'm gonna throw that top strap on it right here in the shade spot. We'll spot in the shade, man, and we're gonna get uh get on the highway, man. Get out of here. Anyway, we got them all three. Not without some uh, without some work, but we got them, we got them all three done. Time to roll. Get up out of here. It is what it is, man. 